out. She near choked us all to death. How choked you? She sent her spirit out. Oh, Mary, surely you... She tried to kill me many times, Goody Proctor. Why, I never heard you mention that before. I never knew it before. I never knew anything before. When she come into the court, I say to myself, I must not accuse this woman, for she sleep in ditches and so very old and poor. But then she sit there, denying and denying. And I feel a misty coldness climbing up my back. And the skin on my skull begin to creep. And I feel a clamp around my neck, and I cannot breathe air. And then I hear a voice, a screaming voice. And it were my voice. And all at once, I remember everything she'd done to me. Why, what has she done to you? So many times, Mr. Proctor. She come to this very door, begging bread and cider. And mark this, whenever I turned her away empty, she mumbled, mumbled. She may mumble hungry, aye, but what does she mumble? You must remember, Goody Proctor, last month, a Monday, I think, she walked away, and I thought my guts would burst for two days after. Do you remember it? Why, I think I do. But, and so I told that to Judge Hawthorne. Goody Good says he, what curse do you mumble that this child may fall sick after turning you away? Why, no curse at all, says she. I only say my commandments. I hope I may say my commandments, she says. And that's an upright answer. Aye. But then, Judge Hawthorne say, recite for us your commandments. And of all ten, she could not say a single one. She never knew no commandments, and they had her in a flat lie. And so condemned her. Why, they must when she condemned herself. But the proof. The proof. I told you the proof. It's hard proof. Hard as rock, the judges said. You will not go to that court again, Mary Warren. I must tell you, sir, I will be gone every day now. I am amazed you don't see what weighty work we do. What work you do? It is strange work for a Christian girl to hang old women. Mr. Proctor, they will not hang if they confess. Sarah Good will only sit in jail sometime. And here's a wonder for you. Think on this. Goody Good is pregnant. Pregnant? Are they mad? The woman's near 60. They had Dr. Griggs examine her, and she's full to the brim. And smoking a pipe all these years. And no husband either. But she's safe, thank God, for they'll not hurt the innocent child. But be that not a marvel, you must see, sir, it is God's work we do. So I will be gone every day now. I am an official of the court. I'll official you. I'll not stand for whipping anymore. The devil's loose in Salem, Mr. Proctor. I will whip the devil out of you. I saved her life today. somewhat mentioned, but I said I never see no sign you ever sent your spirit out to hurt no one. And seeing as I live so closely with you, they dismissed it. Who accused me? I am bound by law. I cannot tell it. I hope you'll not be so sarcastical no more. Four judges and the king's deputy sat with us to dinner but an hour ago. I would have you speak civilly with me from this out. Go to bed. I will not be ordered to bed no more. I am 18 and a woman, however single. Do you wish to sit up? Then sit up. I wish to go to bed. Good night, then. Good night. Mr. Proctor, very likely they'll let her come home once they're given proper evidence. You will come to that court with me, Mary Warren. I cannot charge murder on Abigail. You will tell that court what you know. She'll kill me for saying that. She'll charge lechery on you. She told you. I have known it, sir. And she'll ruin you with it. I know she will. 
good, then her saintliness is done with. We will slide into our pit together. You will tell that court what you know. I cannot tell Tarn My me. wife will never die for me. I will bring your guts into your mouth. But that goodness will not die for me. I cannot. Now heaven and hell are grappling on our backs. And our old pretense is ripped away. Make your peace of it. I cannot. Peace. It is a providence. And no great change. We are what we always were. But naked. I naked. And God's icy wind will blow. I cannot. I cannot. How came you to this turnabout? Has Mr. Proctor threatened you for this deposition? No, sir. Has he ever threatened you? No, sir. Has he threatened you? No, sir. Then you tell me that you sat in my court, callously lying, when you knew people would hang by your evidence? <laughs> Answer me! I did, sir. How were you instructed in your life? Do you not know God damns all liars? Or is it now that you lie? No, I am with God now. You are with God now? I, sir. I will tell you this. You are either lying now, or you are lying in court. And in either case, you have committed perjury, and you will go to jail for it. You cannot lightly say you lied, Mary. Do you know that? I cannot lie no more. I am with God. I am with God. Faint and prove to us how you've pretended in this court so many times. I cannot faint now, sir. Can you not pretend it? I have no sense of it now. Why? What is lacking now? I, I cannot tell, sir. I Might it be here there are no afflicting spirits, but in the court there were some? I never saw no spirits. Then see no spirits now. And prove to us that you can faint by your own will as you claim. I cannot do it. Then you will confess that familiar spirits made you faint. No, sir. Your Excellency, this is a trick to blind the court. It's not a trick. I used to faint because I thought I saw spirits. Thought you saw them. But I did not, Your Honor. How can you think you saw them unless you saw them? I, I cannot tell how. I, I heard the other girls screaming, and you, Your Honor, you seemed to believe them, and I, it, it were only sport in the beginning. But then the whole world cried, Spirits, spirits! I promise you, Your Honor, I only thought I saw them, but I did not. Surely your excellency is not taken by this simple lie. Abigail Williams. I be. And be it a deadly sin, Mary Warren. Abby. Oh, Mary. This is black art to change your shape. Oh, no, I cannot. I cannot stop my mouth. This is God's work I do. Abby, I'm here. Oh, Mary. Please don't come down. Her claws. She's stretching her claws. Lies. Lies! Please don't hurt me! I'm not hurting her! Why did she see this vision? You cannot believe that. She sees nothing! She, she sees, sees nothing. nothing! Abby, you mustn't! Abby, you mustn't! I'm here! I'm here! I'm here! I'm here! Mary Ward, draw your spirits out of them! Mr. Danforth! Mr. Danforth! Have you come past with the devil? Have you? Never, 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 never! Why can they only repeat? Give me a whip! I'll stop it! They're sporting! They're, They're sporting! Abby, stop it! Abby, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! A little while ago, you were afflicted. Now it seems you afflict others. 
Where did you find this power? I have no power. I have no power. They're going, you mister. What came you these past two weeks? You've seen the devil, have you not? I... I... Mary? Mary, goddamn liars, You've seen the devil. You come back with Lucifer, have you not? Goddamn liars, Mary. I cannot hear you. What say you? You will confess or you will hang. Do you know who I am? I say you will hang if you are not open with me. Remember what the angel said to the boy Tobias. Do that which is good and no one shall... Shall... Who is this ready? Oh, Mary, please. Don't. Don't. She's going to come down. She's walking the beam. Look out. She's coming down. <laughs> Oh, God. 